I am concerned about the deal. I am wary about it. I am dubious about it, both for peace process reasons, but also for other reasons as well. That said, all my life I've been a Conservative. I very much want uh, Mrs May to succeed as Prime Minister and to stay as Prime Minister. And I understand why she wishes to shore up her parliamentary position. That is entirely understandable, and I sympathise. But, but, my main concern certainly is the uh, peace process. A fundamental part of that peace process is that the UK government needs to be impartial between all the competing interests in Northern Ireland. The Good Friday Agreement says the power of the sovereign government with jurisdiction there shall be exercised with rigorous, rigorous impartiality. impartiality. That is entirely right. Um, and that, that was always the intention right from the start of the negotiations. And the danger is that however much any government tries, they will not be seen to be impartial if they locked into a parliamentary deal at Westminster with one of the Northern Ireland parties. And you never know in what unpredictable way events will turn out. And, you, and we cannot know if that impartiality is going to be crucial at some stage in the future. If the government do form a deal with the DUP, and I can see that they well might feel that they have to, then it is doubly important, trebly important, to consult on Brexit widely, both in and out of Parliament. I think if that were a joint announcement with any deal with the DUP, I think it would be very helpful because people would see that there isn't going to be disproportionate pressure from one part of the United Kingdom, but that the government really are going to consult with other parliamentary parties, with business uh, and with others who have a direct interest in it. I think we have to recognise that the election changed, if not everything, a very great deal. And the government are going to have to respond to that. The views of the 48% cannot be brushed aside as some of the more rigorous uh, hardline Brexiteers wish.